Have you ever wondered what it takes to get from a piece of raw stock into a precision component that goes into our torque converters, clutches, and power transmission solutions? It starts inside our 320,000 square foot manufacturing facility in Racine, Wisconsin. It's a precision process controlled by the right materials, the right equipment, and highly trained operators. First, raw material is meticulously sourced by our team of engineers for each and every component. A quality product starts with quality materials and quality partners. We begin the turning process, rough turning the raw steel into the start of a highly engineered gear. We drill holes so the component can be assembled later in the manufacturing process. Next up, cutting the teeth. The teeth are the most important feature of the gear because they create the precise ratios of power transfer between rotating elements and drive the transmission. After that, we hand deburr every gear, removing the sharp edges formed when the teeth are cut. The deburring process creates a perfect alignment of all other components. Deburring is followed by chamfering, a process that rounds the edges of the gear teeth to reduce friction and eliminate interference. The gear then moves to one of our qualified partners for heat treating. This process optimizes the performance and extends the life of the gear. While heat treating is a critical step in the process, it can distort the gear. We re-qualify all of the faces by hard turning the gear to provide an exacting surface. From hard turning, the gear moves to bore grinding, a process that delivers a high level of accuracy and perfect alignment of the bore. The gear teeth are ground one final time to guarantee perfection and promote maximum life expectancy. This critical step in the process eliminates clanking, wear on the gear, and inefficiencies. As one final measure to improve the metal's properties, the gear goes through shot peening, an operation that prevents fatigue and stress corrosion failures and prolongs product life for the part. Finally, the gear is put on the balancer at a high RPM and measured by a meter to ensure perfect balance, even wear, and seamless contact. In the end, we've manufactured a critical and precision component piece that continues to drive twin disc forward for the next 100 years.